got my skis. These are what they had here. 150, I need 154, but it's fine. Okay, so Madonna di Campiglio is done. Now we are in Bursa. Three days in Bursa. Uludag, Uludag. You last buying now just ski passes and we're waiting and then we're gonna go up and explore. First ski lift. Then. First time skiing in Turkey. First time skiing in Turkey. We are very excited to see how it is. So even though everything looks very old, like these things, looks fine the slopes. So let's see. Amazing. Hello everybody, hey welcome to the vlog. We are in Bursa. How was the first day, Julia? It was amazing. It was the slopes were really good, uh, sunny weather, everything was amazing. Yes, really good. And now we are going to eat. Apparently it's very popular to eat Iskander here, so I think we're gonna eat that tonight probably. Yeah. And now we're just looking for a shop to buy some water and other things and then we're gonna go find dinner. My mouth the, is salivating. Yes, the fact that we have this next to our house, it is a problem. Now the question is, do they have soaked baklava? I don't let's, see. let's see inside in the fridge in the back. Mm. <sighs> Maybe we'll do some damage, who knows. We are on holiday, so... <laughs> Uh, we tried to go on the on that peak there on the cabin and the way there was so long because it was so big the queues in yeah, the full of people in the today, chairlifts yeah today is saturday today so. is saturday and it's a lot of people and yeah. also like i feel like that area is very much for beginners so it was really full of like people that don't really know how to ski so it I was like yeah so now we're gonna take one ride slope here looks nice looks good and then we're gonna move on to another side and try some new slopes and then find a nice cabin to eat lunch. freezing at all but no. <laughs> we are waiting in this queue for maybe 20 minutes and yeah. we are outside and there is the queue as you can see we're going back to Bursa the other queue we waited for 45 minutes and now in this one I think probably the same and we also did one hour with these things so it's taking too much yeah. but we'll see we'll keep you up to date when we get to Bursa probably in another one hour <laughs> If we get to Bursa, if not, see you tomorrow on the slopes. We'll be here, we'll be here. <laughs> first, first right we have the, the ski boots, they're all here. <laughs> it's been two hours. We stayed in the first queue for one hour, second for the two hours, for another hour. And now we got out of this building through the back because it's a whole marketing situation to go through the shops. And now we're somewhere in the woods. <laughs> it's like a... Like there's a whole... You like, know, like, look, woods, okay? Like in the wild, you lie in the wild. Okay, so now we're gonna go find a taxi. Hopefully, another, Hopefully. Hour, another hour. <laughs> Probably we get home by 10 p.m. You know, might as well not even go out today. Uh, no dinner because it's already morning and we need to go back up. And now we are also waiting for a taxi.
came back to Izmir and it was really nice. The it bus is also 10 out of 10. Yeah. Yeah. Everything was around 10 with Yes, weekend. yes. Even the friends here, they're amazing. So everything was really good. Check your last TikTok. She posted a TikTok about like a little Bursa vlog. So go that. And also my TikTok for like this bus review, which I'm in shock. It looks like a freaking business class from Turkish Airlines. It's amazing. But Romania needs to learn from the Romania needs to learn. Like Turkey is top, top. That's why they're not in Europe. See you in the next one. I hope you liked it. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.